Snake is both a great game and an ancient game. Normally, in Snake, as the name suggests, you play as the snake. But today, I'll be making Snake but you're the apple. This time I genuinely didn't steal someone else's video. I don't even know why I put this clip here but whatever. Now, in order to make a game about snakes, you need to make a snake. So I began working on the snake object. After some time I made the snake. I tried adding a tunge but Godo hates me. Now we have to do some stupid input mapping. It's annoying but it's required. Soon enough we got the uh. Well, it's supposed to work. Eventually I got the snake to work properly. But, there is a problem, the snake grows every time you move. I made the snake a skibidi sigma. Get out! I managed to make it work relatively quickly. How it works is simple, the snake head creates a body part every couple milliseconds, and the body parts will destroy themselves after one second. Anyways I began work on a checkerboard background so the game actually looks good. It was a bit of work but at least I got it done. Here is the background in action. But, the idea of this game is that you play as the apple, not the snake. So it's time to add an apple. Now it's time for me to tell you to subscribe, since this is a channel that is incredibly small and I would really appreciate it if you both liked and subscribed. Thank you. I eventually added an apple to the game, who, in usual sugarcane fashion, is just a red circle. Now it's time to make the AI. After literally spending hours typing, I made a basic snake AI. I then gave the apple the ability to move. I don't know how apples move, they just can. There is a weird bug where the snake just straight up tackles the apple. Although you can push the snake back like what I'm doing now. I don't even know what's happening anymore lol. I guess Godot isn't designed for my horrible programming skills. I still have no idea how a second snake came out of nowhere. After doing a bit of signal nonsense, I was able to make the game end when the snake collides with the apple. Since the snake is slightly faster than the apple, I gave the apple a teleportation ability. But, as you can see, it's a bit overpowered. The solution is simple, add a delay. Anyways, the game is tiny, so I made the camera follow the apple and expanded the map. I also made the snake become slightly faster over time. I finally added a score, and just like that, the game is done. Make sure to like and subscribe for more content.